Hey, hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vegan Brie. If you didn't know already, I do subscription box unboxings as well as vegan grocery hauls, makeup reviews, whatever I'm kind of feeling. So let's get into my paid for BoxyCharm box. I also get it in PR. I already did those unboxings. When we get more spoilers for September, I will be doing a spoilers video as well. I'm also on Instagram and TikTok. So if you're interested in, in cruelty-free and vegan beauty and food content, I would like to subscribe and like. So let me know also, do you get BoxyCharm, Ipsy, Icon Box, other subscription boxes? I also get Fat Fit Fun, um, and I will be doing my unboxing when that comes in the mail. I did get the Ice Cream Beauty Box again, so when that comes in the mail, I will be doing an unboxing on that as well. So first, and I have tried all of these, and while I am talking about these, I will show each product being used. So I have some thoughts. So I will, we, first, let's talk about the What's Up Beauty Positivity Lightweight Hydrating Face Primer. I want to try What's Up Beauty. I am really interested in their lipsticks. Their palettes look really pretty. This cute little baby. Um, I love the rose gold, like, I don't, I don't know. Supposed to be a clean, silicone-free, cruelty-free vegan, um, made in China, and it is one fluid ounce. Again, same kind of packaging. It is it is hydrating. Um, I got no complaints about it. I don't know if it particularly, like, makes my makeup wear longer. It's white, and then it's, it feels like a moisturizer. Like, it does feel hydrating, so. Um, and it does have a little bit of, a little bit of stick to it, which I'm sure helps with makeup wear. Um, but I didn't think it was drying or anything like that. So nothing bad to say about that. Then we'll talk about the product that was one of the products that was chosen for me, which I'm kind of mm, about. It's from Keys Soul Care, which is a Lisa Keys brand. This is the is this is in the shade 130N Extra Light Neutral Porcelain, or I don't know. It's like skin two-in-one concealer and tint. First of all, that kind of was like, I like my concealer slightly lighter than my foundation or I use concealer, honestly, all over my face to swap concealer like I did. Well, I'm not wearing any concealer. Well, a little bit under my eyes, okay? And blemishes that you can't see because I'm far away. But <laughs> um, this tint, it actually has some coverage to it. I don't know if I like it as like a foundation. Under my eyes, I don't know what's going on with my under eyes. Like, been kind of like on a journey off and on where like concealers work for me and then they don't work for me right now they're like I don't know what it is aging's not fun I like the packaging it's pretty I'll show you the shade it is I definitely think it's light I don't know how this is usually I'm like a fair fair neutral I can do fair warm this to me is pretty fair I am tan right now so I did use some bronzer because I felt I looked really light so it blends out um, not really a scent to it, but, and I don't really like this application method. It's just, it's like pointy and I, I put it on my hand or actually no, I did put it on my face, which I don't think is the most sanitary, like putting it back in and stuff, but, um, it settled into, so I have some 11s here and it settled into my 11s. It also wasn't doing great around my nose. Um, it looked a little kind of cakey dry. Um, I only worn it like once, but just first impression, it wasn't my favorite. It wasn't like the worst, but I'm gonna, maybe I'll add some like e.l.f. halo glow to it, like the, you know, filter. And then something that I, now we'll get into things I do like. <laughs> um, this was also, no, this was not, sorry, so this was not chosen for me. I gotta pick it out. This is from Lunar Beauty. This is, the Mood Prism Liquid Blush in the shade Rosa Reina it is so pretty. I'm actually wearing it very, very lightly today. It looks like it's really, it is very pigmented and buildable, but it blends out really nice. Like it's like a serum -y blush and glowy without like the shimmer to it. So it blends out really nice and sheer. Um, let me put it on how it initially looks. So, and then it like it blends out. So, but I think it's really pretty long wearing like all day. I'm excited to, I wanna try more shades, but I was really excited this was in the box because it's fairly new. Like I think it came out like last month um, and it doesn't feel sticky either. Like it's not, you know, tacky, it doesn't like your hair doesn't stick to it. You know, like, I just put it on very lightly today, but I did like two dots and blended it out. And then 
Also, I, I'm wearing very lightly the Buxom Plump Shot Sheer Tint Collagen Infused Lip Serum, which is vegan. I think I got this in like, I want to say it was either Icon Box or Ipsy Glam Bag. Sometimes it happens, you get stuff that reappears. I did pick out the shade in Plush Peach. It is plumping. Um, I don't have like super thin lips, but if you really like put it on there, you get a lot of product and it does plump them out. It does make them plump up. So I do like the shade. Um, I didn't know, I was like kind of debating which shade to go with, but it feels really nice too and hydrating. It has a cooling effect to it. Think like the Buxom um, lip glosses. And it smells kind of minty. Um, and then last but not least, but this will be going into a giveaway because I already have this. This is, and I got this in my PR box. Sometimes that happens, sometimes it doesn't. The Ofra Hot Mess Mama, which I really like her liquid lipstick. But this is the Mini Mix Palette in Unconditional. There is the beautiful Rhonda. She is a YouTuber. It comes with a blush, a bronzer, and a, high, and a highlighter. And then um, all the shades, all the eyeshadows are matte except for the Sweet and Sassy shade. So I have been using this. I'm not using it today. I'm not even wearing eyeshadow today. Um, but it doesn't come with a mirror, which kind of bothers me. Um, but all the shades are, like I said, matte, except for this bad boy, which let me just show you this shimmer. Like, and this is me, like, it is very pretty, but it is very, just for me, it's kind of lackluster. Like to me, can you even see it? It's almost like a satin. Which I'm not saying is bad if that's what you're going for, but that's not what I'm going for. Like when I want like a shimmer, I want like a shimmer. I want some sparkle or metallic. Um, again, maybe that's good for maybe that's good for her. Even as an inner corner highlight, I really have to build it up, which I kind of like a wham bam. Thank you, ma'am, personally. And then I thought that the highlighter, which it does feel kind of dry, there is the highlighter. Let me swatch that next to it. It's definitely more blingy um it feels smoother too but this is not my collab and then actually, i actually have not swatched the green and i only use the purple as a um liner there's the green and the purple i have been using these though i have been using this like all the most of the mattes except for the green and the super dark brown um but i have used this to set my brow bone for my primer and then these three, and I have used the face products too. And they're really pretty. This is like a glowy blush. The bronzers are really nice. Like, um, I'm not wearing it today, but I'll just swatch them. I just swatched the highlighter, but yeah, it's like, it looks glowier on the face, but there's the bronzer. I don't know how this will work on deeper skin tones. It is a nice kind of like neutral um, bronzer, but yeah, so that's the palette. Um, I do like it. Like I said, I've been using this for use it a couple times, but the shimmer is just not my thing. Like even on the lid, do you recommend using a glitter primer? Because without a glitter primer, it really doesn't like, it just, it's not, it just doesn't really, I don't know, stick very well. But that is just my honest opinion. Okay. Over here, I give honest opinions. Like if I've said something in PR or not said something in PR, I'm going to give it, give my honest opinion. Honesty, I want that trustworthiness as I would other people that are like I'd be other content creators I watch or like just like a friend you know so anyway that is what I got in my box from my ipsy I will be doing the spoilers for September as I said later this month so as always stay safe healthy and always do something that makes you happy